wow. Thank you. Watermelon is the best. I will make a cake with this melon.
so much.
Wow, I love it. Delicious. Stop, don't eat chocolate. I will make a chocolate cake for you.
tasty. Sweet! Yummy! for milk. Thank you. Delicious. Oh no, I bought too many things. Let's clean up the house. Hmm, it gives me a new idea to make a cake today. Firstly, I mix egg, milk, cooking oil, and sugar together. I also add flour and cocoa powder here. fondants in the fridge. I will make rainbow fondants become the balls.
After that, I roll out brown fondant and cut into one large rectangle. Next, I press the bubble wrap on it like this. Wow, it really looks like a honeycomb. I spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. Next, I spread chocolate frosting around the cake and press gently to set it in place. I place a smaller cake above. Now I arrange chocolate bars around the body of the first tier cake. And I wrap the second tier cake with brown fondant. Finally, I put rainbow fondant balls on this cake. Wow, I love it! Delicious! Tasty! Don't watch TV anymore. Help me buy some Kit Kat. I put egg, milk, cooking oil, sugar. And flour together mix them up. Thank you, Tom. You can continue watching TV now. I also add melted Kit Kat here and keep mixing. Spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. After that, I spread white frosting around the cake Press gently to set it in place. Next, I pipe zigzag lines of buttercream in rainbow color order around the body of this cake. I also pour melted chocolate on the top. Delicious. Tasty. Oh 
Oh no. I have to clean it up to make a cake right now. Firstly, I put egg, milk, cooking oil, and sugar into a bowl. Then, mix them up. I also add flour and cocoa powder in this mixture. And keep mixing. After that, I will melt some chocolate. Cocoa powder, condensed milk in here. Now, I have a mixture of solids like this. Next, I will make it become many cocoa balls. I spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. I spread chocolate frosting around the cake. After that, I press gently to set it in place. Now, I place a smaller one above to have a two-tier cake. I will pour colorful melted chocolate on the top of this cake. After that, I arrange cocoa balls all over the cake. And also add a white heart and a yellow bow by fondant to finish the cake decorating. Wow, I love it! Delicious! Tasty! Hello! Oh, you come to deliver to me? Thank you so much!
Sweet! Yummy! Results of today's labor. I will try baking with green tea leaves.
to make a cake now. Firstly, I mix egg, milk, cooking oil, and sugar together. I also add flour and cocoa powder here. Continue mixing. I spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. I cut the cake sponge into this shape. After that, I spread a thin layer of white frosting around the cake. And smooth it evenly. I cover this cake with yellow fondant. I pack a large swirl of white buttercream on the top of this cake. I also pour melted chocolate above the buttercream. and attach random candies along that melted chocolate line. Wow. It looks so pretty. I love it. No chocolate. No. Wow, I found it.
Tasty! Sweet! Yummy! Good morning! How are you today? Let's make a cake with me now! Firstly, I will cut and melt this Kit Kat bar. Next, I mix egg, milk, cooking oil, sugar, and flour together. And add melted Kit Kat here. I have some fondants in the fridge. Next, I will roll out each fondant. And then cut it into small squares like this. I spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. I spread white frosting around the cake. After that, I press gently to set it in place. Then, I arrange square pieces of rainbow fondants around the cake body in diagonal lines. I pour white ganache to cover the top of this cake. Finally, I put Kit Kat pieces on top to complete the cake. Wow. 
It looks so pretty. I love it. Let's put the ice cream in here and start making a cake now. I mix egg, milk, cooking oil, and sugar together. Next, I also add flour and cocoa powder here. Our task now is to make them become rainbow fondant balls. Spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. After that, I spread chocolate frosting around the cake and press gently to set it in place. Then, I arrange the rainbow fondant balls in vertical rows around the cake body. I will pour melted chocolate in rainbow color order on the top of this cake. My favorite ice cream will be the final decoration for the cake. Wow, I love it! Delicious! Tasty! This egg is so big. Let's take it home. Firstly, I will cut a small hole in the top of the egg. Next, I pour out the egg white and yolk completely, so that it becomes an ideal mold. Now, I will chop the watermelon and mango into small pieces.
I cut the pandan leaves and put them in the blender to make juice. I also blend watermelon and mango into juice. Do you know? Butterfly pea flowers combined with hot water will create a natural blue color. Then, I will mix the melted gelatin with these kinds of colored water here. Since I don't have orange yet, I'll mix it with orange jam. I pour the jelly mixtures into the egg mold one by one in rainbow order. Let's try peeling it off to see what the result is. Wow, I love it! Delicious! Tasty! Wow, so colorful! I will make a rainbow cake like this.
tasty. Sweet. Yummy. Goodbye. I'll be back soon. Bye-bye, darling. Don't be sad. Come in and make a cake with me. Firstly, I mix egg, milk, cooking oil, sugar, and flour together. for your help. I also add orange, green, and purple food coloring into to each different bowl of cake batter. chocolate I prepared before. Wow, I love rainbow melted chocolate. I spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. Place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. After all, I spread white frosting all over the cake. And smooth it evenly. melted chocolate in a rainbow border on the top of the cake. Finally, I place a fondant rainbow heart on the center to finish my cake. It looks so pretty. I love it. to bring back the rainbow. I will mix egg, milk, cooking oil, sugar, and flour together. Continue mixing. and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. After all, I spread blue frosting all over the cake and smooth it evenly. Buttercream to create a rainbow shape on the top of the cake. Don't 
forget the clouds. The cake will look more like the sky with these star-shaped sprinkles. It looks so pretty. I love it. A beautiful day! Oh, it's time to make a cake! Oh, it's broken! Sweet! Yummy! Now, now, enjoy it! Have you prepared the cherries I ordered before? Here you are. Oh no, I want colorful cherries. Bye, I'll make them at home. We will make colorful cherries with red, yellow, green, and blue fondants. I lift the fondant blocks one by one onto the cutting board, broke them into small pieces, and rolled them into a round ball. Next, I add a stem to each cherry. And I also cover them with silver emulsion. First, I will mix flour, cocoa powder, and cornstarch together. Next, I add egg, milk, cooking oil, and sugar to this mixture. the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. 
After all, I spread chocolate frosting all over the cake. And smooth it evenly. Then, I pipe swirls of chocolate buttercream around the edge of the cake. And also pipe chocolate buttercream around the base of the cake. After that, I top each buttercream swirl with one cherry fondant. Finally, I arrange two rows of heart sprinkles on the cake body like this. I love it. Don't fight anymore. I'll make something big enough for you too. Firstly, I will cut and melt this Kit Kat bar. To make a cake, I need to mix egg, milk, cooking oil, sugar, and flour together. Melted Kit Kat here and keep mixing. Now I put butter, sugar, and whipping cream together to make butter cream. coloring here to have rainbow buttercream. Wow, they look so beautiful. I spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. Place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. After that, I pipe wavy lines of rainbow buttercream from the base to the top of the cake. And smooth them evenly. Next, I pour melted chocolate around the cake edge. Arrange the fondant balls round it, too. Finally, I spread red sprinkles in the center of the cake. Wow! 
Wow, I love it. Delicious. Tasty. Oh my god, are you okay? Don't worry, I clean your face and make you cake. Delicious. Wait, what's wrong with the television? Oh, it looks so pretty. I'm going to make a white version of this cake.
so pretty. I love it. Hi, Tom. Okay, wait for me. Be careful. Goodbye. Hello. Thanks for your help. Firstly, I will break and melt this chocolate bar. oil, sugar, and flour together. I also add melted chocolate here and keep mixing. and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. After all, I spread chocolate frosting all over the cake. And smooth it evenly. swirls of red, orange, green, and blue buttercream around the edge of the cake. I continue to pipe dots of red, orange, green, and blue buttercream around the cake base. Then, I arrange sprinkles on the cake body to make a rainbow. Get to add the clouds with fondant. It looks so pretty. I love it. Wow, 
Amazing. No, no, it's broken. Okay, please put it outside the door for me. Wow, I love it! Delicious! Tasty! Stop jumping around, I'm so dizzy. Take the money and help me buy an egg to make a cake, please. Before we have the egg, I will mix the flour, cornstarch, and cocoa powder together. oil and sugar here. Thank you, Minion. Fondant balls from brown fondant. I spread the 
the bottom layer with white frosting. And add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. After all, I spread white frosting all over the cake. And smooth it evenly. Next, I arrange ground fondant balls around the cake body in vertical rows. Finally, I pipe star-shaped dots of rainbow buttercream to form hard lines on the surface of this cake. Wow! It looks so pretty. I love it. I am the best. No, I am better than you. What are you saying? Wow, so amazing. I will make a cake inspired by it. Firstly, I will break and melt this chocolate bar. Making cakes is very simple. You just need to mix eggs, milk, cooking oil, sugar, flour to to have cake batter. Mix any food coloring you like into the cake batter. Today, I choose blue and purple colors. Spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. After all, I spread blue and purple buttercream onto each half of the cake and smooth them in this way. Next, I pour melted chocolate over the top and let it flow down the cake body. I also place mandem candies around the base of this cake. Finally, I insert a chocolate bar on top of the cake to complete the decoration. Wow, I love it! Delicious! Tasty!
you. Tasty. Sweet. Yummy. Help me. I will make a cake to thank you. Delicious. Tasty. Tom, don't sleep anymore. Come here, I need your help. Watermelon. We're almost out of them. First, I will dice the watermelon, carrot, mango, and avocado. Puree them. 
them in a blender to get the juices. When hot water is poured into dried butterfly pea flowers, they will fade to a blue color. Then, squeeze a few drops of lemon here, the water will turn purple color. Next, I boil the watermelon juice with sugar, milk, and honey. This step is done when the mixture becomes sticky. I also do the same with other juices. Then, I melt the jelly powder in the microwave. Now, I pour the melted jelly into each jam bowl and mix them up. After that, I pour them into a globular mold and let it cool in 30 minutes. wrong. But it's okay. I have a new idea. I cut a lemon in half and remove the intestines. Next, I draw the black lines on the lemon peels to make them look like a watermelon. Delicious! Tasty! Oh no, I don't have money. Let me make you something delicious. Firstly, I mix egg, milk, cooking oil, and sugar together. Also add flour, cocoa powder here and keep mixing. fondants in the fridge, so I will make them become many fondant balls.
I spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. I spread chocolate frosting around the cake. After that, I press gently to set it in place. Then, I arrange rainbow fondant balls around the cake base. I also arrange the chocolate bars above the fondant rows. Next, I pipe swirls of rainbow buttercream around the edge of the cake. At the end, I place the brown fondant balls in the center of the buttercream swirls. so pretty. I love it. Good jobs, Nick and Milo. I will make something delicious for you guys. Firstly, I chop watermelon, orange, mango, and avocado one by one on the cutting board. Then, I put them in the blender one by one to get the juices. To create the blue color, I soak dried butterfly pea flowers in hot water. And create the purple color by squeezing a few drops of lime here. Boil the milk with the gelatin powder and sugar until they become a sticky mixture. I pour the gelatin mixture into the juice bowls and stir them well. After that, I pour jelly mixture into these two molds one by one in rainbow color order. It looks so pretty. I love it. Let's see my performance. Hooray, I won. Oh, they really look like Nickel Nip Wax Candy. 
I'll try making this dessert. Firstly, I will dice watermelon, orange, mango, and avocado one by one. To create the blue color, I soak dried butterfly pea flowers in hot water. And create the purple color by squeezing a few drops of lime here. Next, I boil the watermelon with sugar, milk, and honey. This step will be done when the mixture becomes sticky. I do the same with the remaining fruits. After that, I melt some beeswax. Then, I pour beeswax into the bottle molds and wait 5 minutes for them to be hardened. Now, I pour the fruit jams into the middle of the beeswax bottles. I also pour a layer of melted beeswax on top. Wow, I love it! Delicious! Tasty! Wow, so sweet! Today, I will guide you to make a beautiful dessert. It is Swiss Rainbow Roll Cake. First, I mix egg and milk, cooking oil, and sugar together. I also add flour and corn stacker into the cake batter. After that, I add food coloring to have rainbow cake batter. Now I pour the cake batter into the molding rainbow color order. I take the fondant out of the fridge. and shape them into round balls. Next, I spread white frosting on top of the cake. After that, I scroll it into a roll cake. Finally, I arrange rainbow fondant balls in diagonal lines on the cake surface. Wow, I love it! Delicious!
delicious. Tasty. Corgi, it's not a puppet, it's my candy. I will break and melt it. Next, I mix egg, milk, cooking oil, sugar and flour together. Also pour melted chocolate here and keep mixing. I'm 
mix butter with sugar, condensed milk, and whipping cream to make butter cream. After that, I mix it with food coloring to have rainbow buttercream. I spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place remaining cake layers over the frosting. I spread chocolate frosting around the sides and across the top. After that, I press gently to set it in place. Then, I pipe swirls of chocolate buttercream around the edge of the second tier. I pipe and crisscross the dots of rainbow buttercream around the bodies of two tiers. I put sprinkles on the top of buttercream swirls on the top of the second tier. And on the bodies of two tiers. Wow, I love it! Delicious! <laughs>